Frank Barrington, yes. thank you very much. First question, what makes you angry? I don't like bullies, you know. Uh, never have done. All my life I've fought against bullies and uh, meet a lot of them in my business, you know, producers, directors, other actors. And the uh, worst bully I ever met actually was, uh, he was a runner on uh, one of the, uh, the the superhero films where I played the uh, the German the German scientist. And uh, he, uh, there was something about him now. He, his job was to make the tea, of course, you know, and ask if you needed anything. But uh, he'd just sort of stand there and hover and, and look at you. And it was very, very off-putting, you know. It was, there's nothing he said precisely, but he, he had a very, um, he, he had a very hateful energy, if you know what I mean. It wasn't just me, other people in the crew, I could see they didn't like him. And uh, he had an odd face. And uh, it was very, uh, I found it very oppressive, you know. And, 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 I, and, I, and I decided I, I wasn't putting up with it anymore, you know. Over. Finished. Yes. So one day I said, uh, you know, that's it, you know, I'm, I'm, uh, I'm not going to put up with this anymore. I'm going to nip this in the bud. And I was doing a take and uh, I suddenly caught sight of him, that, that odd face of his in the corner of my eye. And I just, well, I just, I just went for him, you know. I, 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 I just, uh, I tore strips off him, I tell you that much. And uh, he was fired. He was uh, sent off the lot that very day, never worked again. And, uh, you know, that, 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 that put an end to his bullying. Horrible fellow, horrible yes. fellow. Yeah. But you know that's what I do. You know that's uh, that's that's my modus operandi. You know I, uh, I I I root out bullies. You know I'm tough. I'm a tough tough guy. Good you know? to know. Good to know, Frank. Now tell me, um, you you grew up in Ireland. Uh, that's right. Is that correct? Yes. Yeah. Do you read that somewhere? I did. Yes, that's correct. Yeah. Terrific. I was raised in the uh, in the mines of uh, mines of Connemara. Uh, you know. Uh, mining for tin, to have a tin, tin miner, gold. We were gold miners there, you know, little people, you know, that, that's what we did. Okay. Little people, uh, you've so heard you, of a you rainbow and the, the, you know, gold, and uh, Ireland was full of gold at one stage, where the English took it from us. Wonderful, wonderful. And so you must miss Ireland. Right? Oh, horribly, horribly. Yeah. Oh, I, I miss Ireland dreadfully, dreadfully. But you know, the, uh, the Irish government, you know something, they want to take away half of what I earned, you know that. They want to take it away from me. Tax. Right, is that what they call it? Yeah. yeah. Well, here in America, you know, they let you, uh, you know, they, 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 they let you keep your money, and that's why they got the strongest bloody economy in the world. Let me tell you that. So you would be, you would favor small government then. Uh, can I tell you something? In Los Angeles, this is a land of opportunity. You can be whatever you like here. You know what Los Angeles means? It means the angels. It's Italian, you know, and uh, it means the angels, and that's because this is a this is a place of opportunity. You could be something over here. I don't know what you do in Ireland, some 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 wretched thing, I suppose, but you could be big over here. You could be a big man. Well, I've always found that Ireland is a bit of a goldfish bowl. <laughs> what do you mean? What do you mean a goldfish bowl? Well, I mean uh, that uh, people are what always you're saying, trying to. You're saying we fish. The Irish are fish. Well, what I mean by that is that in Ireland, uh, they're always people are trying to drag you down. Drag you down? I drag you down. Talking like that about the Irish? Oh no, no. I don't, I don't let people talk like that about the Irish. Yes, but I am Irish. You know that? Yes, of course I do. I was know born that. in Connemara. I don't like people talking about the Irish like you're talking oh, about. No, no, I'm know. not trying to do the Irish down. The... Well, why don't you stand up for your country then, you sleeveen? Yes. Well, so tell me, Frank, what is it that keeps you here in America? It's a very good question. If I go to the cinema in America, if I order a, a Coke, they give you a full carton of Coke. That's 1.5 litres per person. And if I order popcorn, that's a meal, you know, that's a meal in itself. I suppose I was talking more culturally than, than uh, about the food. Um, I like to interrupt people, don't you? You're a bit of a little bully yourself, actually, aren't you? Oh, no. On the contrary, I, I despise bullies, uh, would, generally. I like to throw your education around, don't you? Try and make people feel small. I never had an education. Yes, but, but you did go to RADA, though. What? You went to RADA. Oh, I suppose you know everything about me now, do you? Well, what did I have for breakfast, then? Uh, you don't know everything about me. What did I have for breakfast? I think you're a bit of a bully yourself. What? Well, well, I what do you mean I'm a bully? Are you trying to... I stand up to bullies! Will we cut there? Is that a... Ah. Do we have a doctor? Yeah, do, uh, so do we have a doctor? Yes, sir.